The process of communicating research findings is a crucial aspect of the research process. It allows researchers to disseminate their findings to the wider community, share their knowledge, and contribute to the advancement of the field. There are several ways that researchers can communicate their findings, including writing research reports and papers, presenting research findings, and disseminating research findings. Writing research reports and papers is one of the most common ways that researchers communicate their findings is through writing research reports and papers. These documents are typically published in academic journals and serve as a way for researchers to share their findings with their peers. Research reports and papers should be well structured and clearly written with a clear introduction, methodology section, results section, and conclusion. The findings should be supported by data and statistical analyses. Researchers should also include limitations and implications of their findings. For example, writing a research paper on the effects of climate change on crop yields in a particular region. The paper is published in an academic journal and is read by other researchers in the field. Presenting research findings is another way that researchers communicate their findings is through presenting their research at conferences or meetings. This can be done through oral presentations or poster presentations. Oral presentations allow researchers to share their findings with a larger audience, while poster presentations allow for a more interactive discussion. When presenting research findings, researchers should focus on the key findings and implications of their research and use visual aids to support their presentation. Example, presenting research findings at a conference on the impact of technology on mental health. The presentation includes visual aids such as graphs and charts to support the findings. Dissemination of research findings. Lastly, researchers can disseminate their findings through various means such as social media, press releases, and online platforms. This allows researchers to reach a broader audience outside of the academic community. Dissemination of research findings is particularly important for research that has practical applications as it can inform policy and practice. Researchers should make sure that their findings are communicated clearly and accurately and avoid oversimplification or exaggeration. Example, disseminating research findings on social media about the benefits of exercise on mental health. The findings are communicated through infographics and short videos to reach a wider audience. In conclusion, communicating research findings is a crucial aspect of the research process. Researchers should aim to communicate their findings clearly and accurately using a variety of methods to reach a wider audience. By doing so, researchers can contribute to the advancement of their field and make a positive impact on society. Thank you for watching.